Okay, check it out. Timmy Zell has been known to dance, but does that make him a dancer? Yeah. Well, I'm not a, really, no. I, but he is with a few this morning. Tim, are, are you planning on cutting a rug this morning? I, I was going to join him, but I'm still day to day with that right hamstring. I mean, right hamstring that I pulled. <laughs> so, Lori Beely, dance team coach, joining me this morning. And, and we're in the brand new Performing Arts Center upstairs in this awesome rehearsal space, right? Yes. Very awesome rehearsal space. We are super excited to have this space. Um, it's a great, obviously the mirrors, the bar, everything that a dancer's dream would need. So we're really excited to have this area. Y'all just went to nationals, right? We did. For the first time in our uh, dance program's history, we got to go to UD, our NDA nationals in Orlando, Florida. How'd they go? Wonderful experience. We almost made it to the finals, but we were just happy with our performances. So definitely want to go back again. Can we get a little taste? Yes, we can. All right, here it is, the Tigerettes. All right, ladies, your music's on. Ah, oh, there it is. It is the Tigerettes right here at Festus High School in the brand new Performing Arts Center upstairs in the rehearsal room. I think I can join in. Hey, keep it right here. We got more Fox 2 News in the morning. 7 a.m. is coming your way. Coverage you can count on. This is Fox 2 News in the Morning. Wayne wanted nothing more than to be a great member of the community, a great police officer, and a great father. The Bon Terre community mourns the loss of a beloved police officer, how some are stepping up to help his family. Weiss Fire customers may have lower gas bills coming next month. Plants like this are the early indicator that spring has sprung. We are at Sherwood Forest Nursery telling you what kind of work you can do in your garden or in your yard. And we want to take a live look right now. This is uh, 70 and Kings Highway where the uh, interstate has been closed for an accident now for about 30 minutes. 70 was shut down at Union. Uh, one lane is getting by though, they say at this point. The left lane at 70 eastbound should be open. Mm, what a mess. No way to start a Friday. And we're at the brand new Performing Arts Center here at Festus High School with the Tigerettes in the rehearsal room. we got more to show you, including a sneak peek of the show that's going to debut the new space. That's coming up. Fox 2 News in the morning. 